Scotland have opted to go 3-4-3 by the looks of it here, Jim. Yeah, Peter, and I would say that this setup is probably mostly geared to the front three. I think keeping them busy with chances is obviously a responsibility for everyone else in the team, so the midfield four in particular are, are keen to get on the front foot and play their part. The back three have just got to get on with it, and at times they are left a little exposed. There's the whistle. And it's Fraser. Robertson. Played into space out wide. Fraser. Drill. Has a hit! of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Forward it goes. Tries to get it forward quickly. Plays it out to the wing. Now, can he capitalise? He's got options out wide. Change to the score, nil nil it remains. Out to the left it goes. Here it is now, short going for goal. It just took too long getting forward. Oh, Peter, the best counter attacks are, are pacey and incisive, we know that, and, and that one never really got going. Crunching tackle. And helps available out wide. Oh, he couldn't quite make it. They just couldn't get into an attacking area. Aimed long and direct. And he's all... Can he score? Oh, terrific run to latch onto it, but the finish is all wrong. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Forward it goes. Oh, he's it shot at goal! That is wayward. Quick thinking and quick control, Peter. That creates a, a little more working space. First half is done, so the other team has broken through. Well, certainly not for the want of trying. 
With an interesting game up to now, but still goalless. So there was the first half. Scotland ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to... He'll have a tip! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. It's got through. He's got away. Gets up to head it. It's broken loop and in again. A great save, real class. Robertson is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Quarter of an hour into the second half. Not long left, and still we await the breakthrough. Played into the middle. Boots it to safety. Defenders on the back foot. Ball. Who's going to get there? Aimed long and direct. Plays it out to the flank. And now the breakaway. Tries to get it forward quickly. He's made sure that that won't get through. And now they can launch a counter. Robertson. Right through the middle, Fraser, and he's cut it out. Gets good distance on it. So, the manager making the last of his changes. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Listen, it may well finish this way because it's been so tight all the way through, but equally, we might still get a moment of magic, a mistake or a refereeing decision to influence otherwise. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Lovely bit of skill there. Dumps it in. Header! Well, to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded. And, and there goes the final whistle. And stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches. Satisfied by organisation and solidity. Little cutting edge at either end, and it finishes nil-nil. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Well, a decent draw, Peter, with a good mix of action and plenty of talking points, and it ended with the right result, in my opinion.